and welcome to part four of our five part buyer beware series on the different costs associated with purchasing your first or next home. I'm Bianca, a local realtor in Denver, and today we are talking closing costs and prepaids. Now what are closing costs and prepaids? Well, these are the fees that are associated with your home purchase. So these things can include, but aren't limited to, lender fees, title and escrow fees, loan origination fees, taxes, prepaid homeowners insurance, etc., etc., etc. Now these fees can run you anywhere from three to 6% of the purchase price. And your lender will actually give you a full list of these fees in a settlement statement so that you know exactly how much money you need to bring to closing to cover these costs. Now we aren't seeing this as much because while the market is shifting, we are still very much in a seller's market, but in a buyer's market, there are some sellers that offer to pay closing costs for the buyer which is a huge savings to the buyer. But again, in a market like the one we're currently in, you won't see this option as much. With new construction, however, builders will sometimes offer to pay a portion or all of the buyer's closing costs, but typically the caveat with that is that you use the builder's preferred lender. These are called incentives. So if you're thinking of purchasing a new built home, be sure to ask the on-site sales associate if the builder is offering any incentives at that time because it may very well be worth the look. Now next week, we're gonna go over the last cost in purchasing your new home, which is your down payment. So join me as we wrap up this series and get you on your way to purchasing your first or next home. We will see you next week.